All right, you can go. Thank you. Hello? Good morning. How can I help you? What do you want? Well, courtesy demands that when someone greets you, you respond. Speak. What do you want, young man? Why, yeah. Well, why am I not surprised? I mean, you reek of uncouthness and rasness. Hey! Hey, 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 hey! You can't come here and insult me, Kaji. They send you from village to come and meet me this morning. If you don't go talk, I'll close my gate to go. Oh, please, please, please. So my name is um, Feiyi. I'll just ignore you. And I'm sure this is um, House 45, right? Mm -mm. Then I chingom they put for your eye, you know, see, are you blind? Anyways, um, you're so rude. God. I'm here to see Lady Kekai. Flora, yeah, Lady Flora Kekai. I'm supposed to be her new chauffeur. <laughs> <laughs> so, your <the> driver. But we should go to the house. I said, Shofa, Shofa, Shofa. Eh, now, Shofi. So, you want to dress? Let's be big grammar. You're a common driver. Look, look, let me make this crystal clear to you. I'm a graduate. Kaji, I'm a graduate. So, I'm working here does not mean I don't know what I'm doing. I see. Come on, driver. So, from what you're saying, you're, how do you expect me to dress when I come here? Run put clothes and palm slippers? That one is your own cup of tea. But dress me, they're not saying a driver you be. No, not this driver. I dress the way I want to be addressed. I'm a chauffeur. Uh, I'm a chauffeur. I'm a chauffeur. Yes. I'm a chauffeur. Okay. Come see Madame Inessi. Look, would you just go in there and let her know that I am here? Because I don't have time to exchange, exchange banters with you. Can you? Please. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Stay here. How dare you? Okay, you're still speaking grammar. Wofa. Wofa. Is that Wofa that you will sleep here till tomorrow morning? I'm brought back away. Makariyachi and Kariyaka away. Abuja, forward niners, liars. Why are all these gate men so ras? God, I just won't put my clothes. Do this. Still morning. Please, I need assistance with my homework. Can I please? I have a lot of work I'm doing here. I don't want any distractions. Please, you can sort that out yourself. Mommy, please. I don't even know if I'm getting it. It is simple mathematics. Solve it yourself. Don't be a blockhead. Do your assignment yourself. Ah. Come in. Aisha. Sorry, uh, Lady Flora. There's somebody at the gate. He said it's a new driver that he wants to see you. For you, Tommy? Um, yes. Something like that. Are you talking to me or somebody in the kitchen? Sorry. Tamara! Lady Flora! Please get a new driver to his room. Make sure it's clean. And settle him in. Yes, Lady Flora. Who's to be like? 
Get out of here. Get out of here! Very stupid human being. Just wait. Can I carry your school bag? Get your bag, get your bag, get your books. Get your books. Get, get your calculator upstairs. Movement, upstairs. I said upstairs. I'm busy. I told you I don't want any form of distraction. You are distracting me. Mommy. I said upstairs. Don't tell me when to swear and when not to swear. Upstairs. Pace it up, pace it up. Your books, your school bag. You don't have to zip it. Put it in. Move it, move it, move it. Pace it up, pace it up, pace it up. I have to tidy now. Okay. You're the maid? Yes. Obviously. Excuse me? I'll just let you do what you want to do. <laughs> You're the maid, obviously. Look at his ugly head. A beautiful girl like you is not supposed to be angry. At least your smile is always making us happy in this house. Hmm? Hey, Paolo, what is the problem? That new driver. You should have seen the way he downgraded me because I'm a house elf. He belittled me with his eyes. Oh, he did the same thing to you? Ah, he did it to you. Ah! Tam Tam, you need to see the drama that happened at the gate earlier. Shut down. Say the no chung over in she. A shot in pepe. Huh? Yes. He's not bigger than all of us. He went to dress like he's going to the office. <laughs> Margaret. <laughs> that guy better mind himself because I will not tolerate any disrespect from him. Oh, he's not better than you, so don't worry. I know them. Abuja fake boys. I'm sure he went to borrow all those clothes. You just go and press my damn. Throw my table. <laughs> hey, hey. Tam Tam, you see? This is where you're supposed to be laughing every time. You know, it's out that butterfly in my tummy. King Gane, I. Right, you started again. You know I don't like this. You like to spoil conversation too much. Oh. Yeah, tam Tam. Even God say I appreciate beauty if you see one. And I'm appreciating you now. You don't want to appreciate me back. Haba. Me is like you get Tam Tam. Bye, Kyopa. Okay, thank you, but no thanks. Huh? I don't like it when you start to follow this, okay? I don't need to hear all of those your lies. You know I'm not interested. Tam Tam. Tam Tam. Mm. Don't do this to me now. Don't do this to me now. Is that the reason why you didn't come out? You didn't do it? I was missing you so much. You locked yourself inside the room all to me. Don't miss me. Better start going to that your girl on the other compound. Yeah, I don't want you. Come, come. Come, come. Allah, Isa, Allah, Isa. 
Let's go. Mommy is waiting for you. I don't want to go to school. Why? I didn't do my quantitative reasoning homework, and now my teacher scolded me. Kella, but why didn't you do it? Who oh, good kids always do their homework? I know, I wasn't getting it. And my mom refused to teach me. But I'm telling her, please teach me. Your mom will be angry if she finds out that I helped you do your homework. Oh, she never knew. Kella, how can I do your homework? I know myself. I didn't even finish secondary school. I stopped at SS1. I won't be able to help you with your maths. Please, Madam Tom Tom. Please help me. Just try. Okay, let me see. Why is your There we go. It's here. But I don't want you to fail. I don't want to do this. I wouldn't in... fail. I wouldn't fail. Don't worry. Believe in yourself. See? Now you should write it yourself. So, this is, this should be. Good morning, Lady Flora. Good morning. Aren't you a bit overdressed for a driver? I prefer to look good at all times. It's good. I like it. Thank you. Let's see how long you keep up with it. Good morning, ma. Good morning. I'll get you up. Are you sure? So useless. So useless. Which planet did it come out from? But I'm Floyd did not check for his mental health condition before employing him for this job. Nah, it's obvious. He went to borrow suits, borrow style, borrow trousers. I put her boys. Package it. They can package. He wants to impress Madame so that he will enter Madame. Hey, he, oh didn't you hear what he said? He said, hey, I want to look representable every time. I want to look representable every time. I'm in the kitchen, Jerry. Don't forget my food, though. Okay. My tam tam. Hey! Tam tam. I pray you out, tam tam. Yes, come in. Your breakfast. Good morning to you too. Hey, what is this? Isn't this rather too small for a grown-ass man like me? 
hey, hey, what are you doing? I'm what? taking it back, of course. You said you don't want it. Ah. Wait, why is everyone in this house so rude? And manifest. I beg your pardon. Hey, you're on the same level, okay? You are just a driver here. So don't expect anyone to treat you like a king. Hey, wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Okay, <laughs> okay. Wait, we're on, we're on what? The same level? What? Listen, I am nothing like you and that gate man out there. Okay, just take a look at you. Do you have a mirror? Take a look. I have one. You are a chef. For God's sake, a chef. Do you know where the word chef was coined from? The amount of professionalism that was infused into that name, chef. I mean, look! Dirty and shabby clothes, unkept hair. Everyone will mistake you for a beggar. Can't you see? Lit God! Look, please drop my food before you, you put some dirt in it. Give it to me. You just love you and like your food in the first place. It's a miracle I even eat your food. You should be grateful, it's just that it's sweet. Big or small food. Just, just look here, sweet. I won't be eating it. I mean, why want to walk here though? Okay, just take a look at you. Do you have a mirror? Take a look. I have one. You are a chef. For God's sake, a chef. I mean, look! Dirty and shabby clothes, unkept hair. Everyone will mistake you for a beggar. Can't you see? Good evening. Good evening. Are you hungry? Your food will soon be ready, okay? No, I'm not hungry. I just came here to tell you that on my homework I got three over seven. Oh, but that's poor. I told you I was not so smart. But I'm telling them you're smart. Well, at least I didn't get zero. Some of my classmates got zero and they got laughed at. But they didn't laugh at me. That still doesn't make me feel better. I still wish I was smarter. You're smart, just believe in yourself. Believe. Yeah, Ryan, your food is hungry already, okay? Do you want me to help you? No, it's okay. Okay, I'll just stay here and watch. Are you sure you don't have any homework to do? No. Nope. Make sure you get everything on the list. Start with the beauty cosmetics first. And then he takes you to the market to buy the food stuffs. What you have there is going to be enough, certainly. Um, Madam, I can um I don't mind taking a cab. 
so that he doesn't need to drive me in case you need to use the car. My rules. Faye will take you to the market to buy whatever it is you are buying. Do you understand? Yes, Madam Flora. Take a cab so you can begin to look for your boyfriend around. Boyfriend? Hey. Take her to the market. Okay, Lady Flora. Trying to instruct me on what she wants to do. Nuisance. Hey, hey, where are you going to? To sit at the back, of course. What does it look like? Uh, sit down at the back as what? That's the, I'm your driver or what? Are you not a driver? Who is a driver? I'm a chauffeur. I don't like what you're doing, though. No. I don't like what you're doing. I said go and sit down at the front. Chauffeur, I'll kill you then. If hey, I hey, 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 look, respect yourself. You want me to sit in front so that someone will see the two of us and think we're a couple, eh? God forbid. Wait, 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 sit down. See, see, see who and who as couple? Me and you. Are, are they blind? Can they not see the difference between how can somebody think in this life that someone dressed like this and like as you are will be coupled with me? Is the person stupid? Or they will think that this kind and beneficial rich man gave this helpless woman a lift? You kind. Does that word even exist in your lineage? Yes. I've been clear road and let me Look, sit down. I don't have strength to argue with you. Is it that you enter this car or I'll go and tell Lady Flora now that, that you don't want to go? Go to the front. Come, come. Let's go, George. Come down. What's that? Come down. Okay. What's happening? Where are you going with this over Sabi boy? Rashida, I swear if I had my way, I would prefer rather to walk all the way to the market than to let this stupid driver take me there instead. I, I'm not a driver, chauffeur. Hey, hey, chauffeur. Sure. Yeah. So, chauffeur. Hey, hey you go and open the gate. Let's get out. Hey, hey, hey. hey no triumph. Oh my god. No triumph! You're crazy. He's so ill managed. Do you think I'm tam tam? Do you think I'll have me around? No. If you hit this guy again, I'm going to tell him to for you. Oh, blue, you. Bro, I'll make a you in this house. Yellow, Papa. Share, go, 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 Tap them, come down, let me. What do you want to do? You want to tell me? Come on, pass, let me see. It's yours. What's that? Who's that? Oh, it's me. Oh, hi. How are you? I'm fine. Um, Mommy, I was wondering if you could style my hair. I'm really getting really bored of it. No, um, Kella, your hair is still perfect. Okay, you can still use it till next week. Mommy, please. It's always been Madam Tam Tam and the stylist that has always been styling my hair. Kella, I'm trying to arrange for a Zoom meeting. Not now, please. Besides, the hair is still very neat and you can use it for another week, okay? Oh, can I see this song? Oh, God, I've spoken nicely. Go, go, go. Give me a minute. I'm in a meeting. Hi. One minute. No, no. Go back. You can't. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Love you. Bye. 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 I'm busy now. Thank you.
What are you saying? What do you mean you couldn't find him? I finished buying my things, only for me to come out and see he was nowhere in sight. Maybe you decided to take a cruise with your car for a bit, but me, I couldn't wait. Take whose car on a cruise? What is wrong with you people? Said if you are trying to wait, but I was delaying, so I just left. You just left. What is wrong with you people? Hello, Lady Flora. Faye, where are you? Hello? Don't fringe as if you can't hear me. Hello? If you are not back home in 10 minutes, you will see your face on every single screen as a wanted criminal. What's wrong with you people? <laughs> That's how these drivers behave these days. They like to show off with their bosses' cars as theirs. I'm a bit confused. Why are you still standing here? Sharing an opinion that I do not need. Oh. Sorry. The next time you try this, kiss your job goodbye. Mm -hmm. Leave her with all due respect. I didn't go anywhere else with the car. She's lying. Who's lying? But I'm sure does not tolerate such nonsense. Just admit to the truth that you took a car out to go and impress some girls of yours. Tamara, are you okay? You left me at the market. No, you left the Lady Flora's car. I bet you can't swear to that. That's enough. This is your final warning. You misbehave, you lose your job. Don't clown around. But Lady Flora... Don't clown around. That's your final one. Mm. You choke on that saliva. Back to send that. Back to send that. So, see your hair. So. <laughs> this is just the beginning. He doesn't know who he's up against in this house. You preach peace, I'll give you peace. You come out with a pistol, I'll come out with an AK-47. And fire everybody, right? <laughs> he does not know, don't mind him, with his tiny leg, like Fulani leg. He does not know that uh, this house 45 belongs to my tam tam. Don't mind that useless boy. <laughs> Look at his leg, look at his leg, look at his leg, look at him. What? What? Ovasabi. Oh, Why is he coming out with a bucket to fetch water? He doesn't know. That's the Ovasabi I'm talking about. I've not pumped water yet. <laughs> look at him. Um, the little girl. Madam Flora is really not giving this little girl attention, eh? At all. I think the divorce is really affecting her. You know, divorce affects people differently, especially with the children. I agree. But she could have at least allowed her husband to take the child. He has been begging, begging, begging her that he wants her custody, but she refused to even see him anytime he comes to this house. I don't know why. Hmm? But she leave it. Don't say that. Look, look how she's doing. Mm. 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 I already saw you. Mm, that's not true. Or is someone getting smarter by the day? What are you drawing? A flower. A flower? That looks like someone's head. Good to flower. See. Si. Madam Tam Tam. Yes. Why are you always so nice? 
Why aren't you always getting pissed off like my mom? <laughs> but maybe that's because I have less things to worry about, unlike your mother who has so many things to think about. She doesn't care about me. I don't even tell her my school stories anymore. Your mom cares about you a great deal, Kela. You know, I believe she'll come around again. Sometimes adults just need some time to themselves. Mm -hmm. All right, so which flower are we drawing? A daisy. A daisy? My aunt Santa. Mm-hmm. Why didn't you go to school? <sighs> well, my father wasn't rich enough to send all of us to school, so the girls had to drop out whilst boys had to continue. Why? Let's just say that's how it was back then. But I do have plans of going back to school in the future. But you're gonna be old. Too late. No. It's never too late to follow one's dreams. Yeah. Alright. Enough of the questions and let's draw your flower. Seven. Okay. Draw me a sunflower. Sunflower or sunflower? Sunflower. 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 Sun. Flower. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Tomorrow? We try for you to get ready. We're going right now. Okay, my dad. You just skip me. I'm so sorry. You sleep in a couple of minutes. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. Let me just get dressed and then I'll be chill. Yeah. Um, Madame said... Oops. I didn't realize that's an apology for barging into my room. Then you should have kept your door locked. Really? Wait, so good manners now is now scarce and expensive that you can't afford it? Listen, don't start. It was a mistake. My friend, open your eyes, Joe, and, and tell me what it is you came here for. Talking nonsense. Still looking. What do you want to see? Madame says you should come and get the car ready. She wants to go out now. Good, you can get out. What is even wrong with you? Why are you so mean and frustrated? <laughs> you know, this world would be a better place without you in it. Oh, really? Wow. Says the person that her lies almost cost me my job. Where are you supposed to be? Are you supposed to be on this earth too? You're supposed to be on Uranus. We have people that dress like this. Ah. I'm sure that's where you get these clothes from, Uranus, right? Where did you even get these your clothes from? What boutique? Or oh, is it bend down select? Even bend down select, like really? Have you seen yourself? How is it that you walk in this house? I'm shocked. I'm honestly shocked. How is it that Lady Flora, in her own elegance and glory, allows somebody like you walk as a chef? I'm sure no man stops you when you walk by on the streets, right? Only this guy, what's his name? Rashid and his kind get men, right? Mansura, Mansura to the Baba. Ah, you know why I want to get married to you? You, you know, you remind me of my grandmother. You know, the beauty of that my grandmother is I'm just seeing it in your face. And I have wanted to be there in my house. That's why I want to get married to you. But it's in Kerak, it's in Kerak, it's in Kerak. Tam Tam, Tam Tam. What happened to Tam Tam? Th Hope it's not that boy with the mango hair that's making Tam Tam. Very angry like that. When the yard to the yard and the the yard and the yard and the yard and the the you're supposed to be on Uranus. We have people that dress like this. Ah. Have you seen yourself? How is it that you walk in this house? I'm shocked. I'm honestly shocked. I'm sure no man stops you when you walk by on the streets, right? Wait, wait, wait. Sit down. See, see, see who and who has couple. 
me and you. Are, are they blind? Can they not see the difference between how can somebody think in this life that someone dressed like this and like, as you are will be coupled with me? Is the person stupid? Or they will think that this kind and beneficial rich man gave this helpless woman a lift. Something. So, you've made new Esther. The dressing has changed. Even the way you walk now has changed. Tom Tom, what is happening? Make it by one. So, because I'm a house girl, I shouldn't dress nicely. Tom Tom, I didn't say so. I, all I'm just saying is that, Kijito Sayina, yeah, please. I don't want, I don't want you to, I don't want anybody to take you away from me. If that happened, I would die. I will, look, high blood pressure will catch me. My heart will jump out of my body. What well, like it, I like it. Then you will jump and break those legs of yours. Rashid, how many times have I told you to stop telling me these kind of things? But why? Why, my love? Because I do not feel the same way. You are a friend and it will remain like that. Damn. Allah, Mana, please. I, uh, I have good plans for us. So. I'm telling you. Hey, you know that my cousin I told you about that is working in Dr. Senator Rabbi Musa Kunkoso's house. That he's trying to get me a job in that house as the get man. He, if you succeed, I'm going to bring you in. You'll be the head of the maid in that house. And I'll be the head of the security while you are head of the maid in that house. Me and you will be there. You know, we'll be enjoying our life gradually there. As maid and security. So actually, you don't have any better plans for your life. So you're not tired of these kind of jobs. Uh, why should I? We earn more money than those people working at the office. Tam, let me tell you, eh, I'm a Polytechnic graduate, and I know the reason why I decided to work in this place. But me, I have different plans, so... I know why I'm still working here, because I want to make my money. I want to reach my target, so that as soon as I get what I'm looking for, I'll open up a business. In Nigeria? Do you think all this business works, sir? Look, you are working here, you are eating free food, the same food you cook, you even eat better meat than even the one you serve, madam. Look at your house. Look at where madam kept you. Free accommodation, everything. Since you have been working over one year, you have saved enough money to take very good care of yourself and your family. So tell me, which business do you want to go and do out there that is better than this one? I should go forbid that I remain a house girl for the rest of my life. Tom, Tom, there's nothing wrong with that. Kinji? You should be even proud and happy that after you leave Madame's house, you are going to work for all these governors, all these ministers, uh, Odetola, the richest man. You should work for him. You should be, you should be finding ways to go and work for him. From uh, from Odetola, you should move to that actress from Odetola's house and go and work for her. Then you will know that you are a big housemaid. Anywhere you go, you say, "I work for Odetola. I work for Odetola as an housemaid." It's a proud thing to you. Well, as for me, I want to make money, start a business, and return back to school. Oh, I see. I see that your senses has left your body since 1986. I'm telling you something that you help you and you're saying something else. You don't have sense at all, at all. Maybe it's because I'm standing in front of you. That's why you have the impudence to insult me. Why don't you let your sisters or your future daughters become house girls? Make, make. Let me, let me. Let me, let me. 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 Let
It's not because of the situation self that I'm finding myself. You can't one key person. this fight and we can be good friends, you know. I'd rather be friends with a gamma lizard that knots up and down and crawls on his stomach than with a person like you. <laughs> okay, you definitely have a good sense of humor. You think this is funny? From now on, I will not bring your food here. You will come to the kitchen and take your food yourself. Why? But you take Rashid's food to him, is that not the way it has been? I do not work for you. You will die of hunger if you don't come to the kitchen and take the food yourself. Watch and see. Actually, big for the first time. <laughs> See, I told you we can be friends. She even added plantain <laughs> and two meats. Wow. Okay. Ah, oh, seriously, I do not believe that I can be this lonely without a man. No, that's not what I mean. I mean, like, I don't need any man at all. I mean, they're all the same. They'll give you a headache at the end of the day. Ah. You are just a sports person, I swear you don't sport. Okay, leave my phone. Just drop, drop your phone. In fact, what am I even saying? Good night. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> no, no, Bridget, no. Oh. No. Bridget. just noticing that this guy is cute. Hmm. No, Flora, no. He's your driver. Stop. But what if he's good in bed? Mm-hmm. Stop, Flora. Stop. And Rashid, Rashid Afa, uh, please, uh, has Tamara brought your food yet? Am I the one you're talking to? Come on, man. Look, we might have our back and forth, but we're not enemies. Look, I just want to know if food is ready. Yes, and I've eaten. My Tam Tam brought my food one hour ago. Come on, Abush. And this is a lesson to you. 
Anywhere you go next time, don't ever fight the head of chef of any house. Kaji! It's okay, I'll just go to her myself. Better. Better for you. Better go and apologize. Or else Onga will kill you. See, Kashika! With this your pride, better keep it. So show that we carry your body. Keep it down! So that you can eat good food before you die. Hey, it's got away. My God, what's going on here? Jeez. Zahara! Zahara! you keep yourself occupied with your games or your drawings while I go clean up the kitchen quickly? Or do you want to join me in the kitchen? No, but Madam Tam Tam, uh -huh. please can I use your phone to call my daddy? You want to call your daddy? Okay, you can use mommy's phone when she gets back, okay? But she wouldn't let me. I want to go and be with my daddy. I don't want to be here anymore. Kella, you don't want to be here anymore? Why, my darling? She doesn't love me anymore. She doesn't even care about me. No, darling, that's not true. Look, Madam Tam Tam, are you going to call my daddy or not? But I don't even have your daddy's number. Mommy will not be happy if she gets back and finds out that you don't want to stay with her anymore. Madam Tam Tam, she doesn't even love me anymore. I don't want to be here. I want to be with my daddy. Okay. Calm down, okay? Listen. When mommy gets back, I will tell her everything, okay? Please don't tell her. I'll tell her so you call your daddy, okay? Now let me go and finish up in the kitchen. I'll be back shortly. Okay. Mwah.
Pak Sen ke suara kamu. Sen. Thank you very much, Mark. Um, I will have you know that I usually don't take this type of gesture for granted. And um, Ma, please, you can deduct the hospital bill from my next salary. I haven't asked for it. Thank you very much, Ma. I'm grateful. Still doesn't mean I forgive you for lying. You didn't feel it in your resume that you had asthma. Why did you hide it? I really don't have any reason, Ma. I just felt it was not necessary since I'm a very careful person and I know how to avoid the triggers. I'm really sorry. Nope. It is extremely necessary that every single person who's working with you or around you knows about your medical condition. I mean, what if it was an emergency? What if I wasn't here? Then what? I know better. Well, since you have asthma, any allergies? No. Take the week off. Rest, get better. I'll drive myself for the time being until you get back. Oh, Boma, I'm good. I can drive. I insist that you take the week off, like I said. Rest, get better. I'll drive myself. Good? Thank you, ma'am. Welcome, Lady Sarah. So your intention has always been to set my house ablaze. I'm sorry for my carelessness, Lady Flora. Well, unfortunately, I am sorry cannot buy a bag of cement. Neither can I am sorry build a house. What would have happened if Faye wasn't here to put off the gas? I mean, I'm, I'm wondering what would have happened. Please forgive me for my carelessness. It will never happen again. It better. It better not happen again. Where's Kela? I just tucked her into bed. Hmm. Madam Flora, mm -hmm. please, how is Faye doing? He's fine. She's been in his quarters now, resting. God. Um. Madam Flora. I don't know if it's in my place to tell you this, but um, I think Keller feels a little love starved. What, what does that mean? Um, she was crying early on that she wanted to go to her father. She feels neglected by you and wants to go and live with her father. Very well then. Have her bags packed. I'll dump her there tomorrow. Eh? I, I was thinking that... I didn't ask your opinion. I gave you an instruction. Have her bags packed and I'll dump her there tomorrow. If the little sport brat wants to spend time with her father, she can be my guest. That miserable, lying, cheating father of hers. She can go there. Compare and contrast. Mm hmm. She looks like him. His blood runs in her vein. So she should be my guest. Um, this is the time when you walk away.
Yes, who's that? Come in. Good morning. Good morning. Um, I've been rolling in guilt since yesterday. I'm totally sorry about what happened. I totally forgot that I put food on the fire. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, this type of things, they happen. Mistakes are inevitable. Alright? So, how do you feel now? Fine. I feel so good. <laughs> and I'm sorry that I didn't bring you in here a long time. It's fine. I actually didn't expect you were going to find it easily. Yeah, I'm doing a secret. I usually look for it myself. <laughs> no, thank you for making an effort to help me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're an healer. Thank you. Tamara. You look good. Thanks. Come, Tom. Why are you smiling? Any good news? Oh, am I smiling? I'm not smiling. Oh, you are smiling. <sighs> what is happening here? <laughs> what do you mean, what is happening? Rashid, listen, I'm busy in the kitchen. Leave me, Joff. <laughs> So I hear you want to go live with your daddy? No, tell me. Say it to my face. Tell me what you said to Tamara. That you'd rather stay with your daddy than me? You think he'll take better care of you than I will? Let me tell you what will happen when you go stay with your daddy. You see the school you're in now? He'll have to change you to a poorer one. You see all of those toys and games I get you? You have none of that. You know why? Because he's broke. I miss him. Good. Still your choice. Would you rather stay with your father? Or would you rather stay with me? Kela, mommy or daddy, who would you rather stay with? I'll, I'll stay with mommy. Good choice. Go to the bathroom, brush your teeth, wash your face. Breakfast is ready. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's been two years, two months, two hours ago Since the last time you hit the road And this house has not been the same I saw the missed calls, flowers, and letters you wrote No, Tom, Tom Please, can you assist me to my homework? Maths again. Okay, I'll try. Thank you. I'm very close. No, it's fun. I was supposed to write six. Good morning, people. Good morning, Uncle. Good morning. Yeah. Two times two equals twenty-two, right? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. 
six. Maths? Yeah. The kind of maths they give children these days. Even I can't solve them sometimes. <laughs> you know, in our time, it used to be simple addition and subtraction. Just simple things. What to eat? But on time time, you skip number two. Mm, I know. I want to solve the ones I understand first. Do you mind if I help? Sure. Let's see. Mm -hmm. What's going on here? I'm assisting Kela doing her homework. <laughs> you? <laughs> I mean, you are assisting her with her homework. You who didn't finish secondary school. What do you think? You think this is one plus one is two? Get away from there! Go to the kitchen and do your work. You want the child to fail our assignment? Move, move, move. But, mommy, Madam Tam Tam used to assist me with my homework. Madam Tam Tam used to assist me with my homework. You want the house help to help you do your homework? Do your work yourself. <laughs> she wants to help her do her homework. Stop being great. Wants to help her do her homework. <laughs> Yes, come in. Oh. Um, good afternoon, Lady Flora. Good afternoon. Bring it in. I got you these. I have seen how diligent you are at your job. Neat, hardworking, intentional. I love to reward diligence and hard work. Thank you, Lady Flora. Check it out, would you? <laughs> Whoa. I knew you'd like it. You love shirts. And you do make them look good. Um, I, um, <laughs> I'm sorry. Feel free to ask me for anything you want, okay? Okay. Do you like it here? I mean, I could move you to any of the master's bedroom upstairs. Oh, no, 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 no. This place is perfect. It's cool. I actually like it here. Thank you. <laughs> okay. If you say so. So, um, sorry about what happened in the morning. And I think you're a smart and intelligent woman. Kindergarten mass has nothing on you. You don't have to say that just to make me feel good. <laughs> like I promise you, I'm not saying it just to flatter you. I really think you're smart and intelligent. And you can cook, too. 
<laughs> I see you want to go back to school. How do you know? Uh, let's just say Rashid and you don't talk quietly. <laughs> <laughs> Um, how about we go for a stroll later in the evening when you're done with work? Okay. Okay. So you will let me know when you're done? Yeah. Alright. So I'll see you later then. Alright, see you soon. Alright. Alright. You're not washing your clothes anymore. I actually just wanted to talk to you. <laughs> Hi. even before you come to this house. Okay. And uh, the way I'm seeing you coming close to her, I don't like it. Mm-hmm. You know, I, I want to get married to her in future, so I, uh, you need to stop going close to Tamara. I told her, I'm going to get married to her. Wait, you want to get married to Tamara? Yes. <laughs> Rashid, Rashid. <laughs> okay, you think I, I've not seen you without Nyari Nyanes though? That one, that other compound. Eh? That night when I was driving out, you think I did not see you and her when you were hiding there? I saw you now. Eh? After you took that your brantashi, that thing you put under your bed. No, come now, let's talk about it. Where are you looking? Eh, talk now. Rashid, answer me now. Where are you going to? No, come now, let's go and talk about it now. Let's join just Tamara about it. Eh? You want to wound her with Bratashi? Eh? Fee. Eh? Fee. Rashid. Okay, I tell him. Eh? No, come, let's just just now. Alpha. Buy everything on that list from Gregor's supermarket. Every single thing. Yes, but they will take you. Okay, Madam Flo. I do not have time or the energy for excuses. No excuses. Not at all, Lady Flora. Go. Shouldn't take you time. Oh, 
Ja, zie je dat, maar. Help me met de kit. Rashid. Abang kayak ayi, kesan ni begini. Ini iska kawan, bura ubah. Mak ayat si, Abu Jah fake boys, liars. That's good, you know, you know what you want. And I'll be leaving house 45 soon, so I've been applying for some jobs and I believe one of these days I'll get one of them. I'm happy for you. I wish I could leave too, but I'm, I'm still trying to gather some money so I can do what I want with it. But honestly, I'm going to miss you when, when you leave. Hey, relax. I'm not going to the job yet, so there's no point being sad now. <laughs> All right, I'll chat up. Last big chat. Don't go and crash Madame Flores' car. Yeah, no. Are you, you just yeah. like me saying I'm a chauffeur. Oh. I'm a chauffeur. I'm the best driver in the okay, world. Okay, what's the difference between a chauffeur and a driver? Well.
Kayla. Kayla. Kela, Puma? Are you deaf? Aja, Kela is somewhere inside the compound. I locked everywhere. This gets. Aja. You left the gates open? You left the gate. Oh my god. 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 Hello, Bridget. Hello? Bridget, Kela is missing. Kela is missing. This dummy left the gate open and she left. I, I, I don't know where she is. I don't have any idea where she is. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No, I've, che I've checked everywhere. I've checked everywhere. Here by yourself. I want to go and meet my daddy. Madam Thompson, please let's go and meet my daddy. Wait, how did you even make it past Rashid? How did you walk out of the gate with nobody noticing you? Kel, what are you doing here? Don't you know it's so risky to come here by yourself? Your mom will be so worried about you right now. Let's go home. Leave me alone. She hates me. No, she does not hate you. Don't say that. Mommy loves you so much, okay? She may not show it that much, but she really, really does love you, okay? You're lying. No, I'm not, darling. Your mom loves you so, so much. Trust me. Now, please follow me home, okay? For my sake. Please. I'm going to tell my daddy first. After, okay? Let's go home first, okay? Good girl. Let's go. I don't want to go. <laughs> oh, okay, now let's go. Daddy, I don't want to go. Daddy will come. Daddy, don't worry. Your daddy. No, you shouldn't do this again. It's very risky. Sit in front, please. Watch your hands. Let me activate the child lock. Do you love Tam Tam? Okay. So you have to be obedient. I don't want to go. Somebody help! Hold up. Wait, did you go out with her? Um, we actually found her on the street. What? To run away from home? But you know that's the wrong thing to do. Leave me alone. You hate me. I wish I could just be with my father. Wait, wait, no. Thank you. I don't want to see you wait. here by tomorrow. Rashid, how come now? How did you allow her to leave this compound? I even though I, when you and your sweetheart went out, I was trying to close the gate. Hey, it's okay. You won't lose your job. Just calm down. Please. Is this serious? Please, you need to help me. Don't worry. Don't worry. But let me get the groceries from the car. I'll be back. Tom, Tom, you look at me. 
You help me. Honey. Honey, I'm sorry. I don't hate you. I could never hate you and I never will. But you do. You don't even help me with my homework. You don't even play games with me. And you never even plait my hair. I'm sorry. Mommy is... Mommy is a bit frustrated. And I... I shouldn't pass that frustration on to you and I apologize. But you're always yelling. I guess mommy isn't handling her separation from daddy very well. Mommy misses daddy and erroneously I'm transferring aggressions, which is wrong. And I'm sorry. Henceforth, I'll bleach your hair, play games with you, and I'll help you with your homework. But you have to promise me that you will never run away from home again. I promise. I love you, baby. I love you too. I mean, if anything ever happened to you, if I couldn't find you or anything happened, I possibly would have dropped dead. So if you promise you'll never run away from home again, I'll call daddy so you can talk to daddy. I promise. I'm sorry. I've learned my lesson. Pardon me, madam. Please pardon me. Please, what please. you have done is beyond pardon. You messed with my daughter's life. What if she was never found? What if she fell into the hands of the wrong people? Uh, madam Kia. You, you just think you make a mistake. You kneel down and say you're sorry and that will fix everything. Madam Kia, will you... Lady Flora, please. Please. Please forgive him. Rashid has never done anything like this before. I see what's going on here. You almost burnt down my house. I didn't send you away. And that gave you the effrontery to kneel before me and plead the case of another stupid person. Right? Rashid, go and pack your things and leave this place. Ma, please. I think Tamara is right. Rashid has not done anything of this sort before. I'm sure it was just an oversight or foolishness on his part. Please, let's just pardon him since this is the first time. I'm sure he will not take a second chance for granted and jeopardize it. Please, hey, stand up. Can you, can you just stand up first? Thank you very much. You are the only reason I'm reconsidering him because he's a complete nuisance. It's just because of you. Anyway, sit down. I wanted to have a discussion with you. Both of you can go. <laughs> madam, Allah is so kadikida al kaili, madam. Madam, madam, you will never lack. But the dear man, Allah, madam, you will never lack, madam. Now go to Miki, madam. Now go to Miki. Madam, now go to Miki. Madam, Kichi, now go to Miki. One person possibly employ two very stupid people and have them in my house. Oh, um, and please, please sit. I'm also going to be needing your CV to give to a friend of mine who I'm certain her company will need your service. Wow. <laughs> oh, huh? oh, sit, sit, please, please. Oh, thank you very much, ma'am. Thank you very much. I honestly don't know how to thank you. It's nothing. You're welcome. <laughs> You're honestly the only reason I'm letting Rashid off the hook. I was really upset with him. I understand. <sighs> so, do you see me? I'll bring a hard copy. Okay. Okay. Um, so, let me, let's just chat a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Tell me about your CV. <laughs> CV. Uh, 
Tam Tam, what is the problem? Tam Tam, are you okay? You don't look happy. I think Madame Flo likes Faye. She has eyes for him. I think so too. Yeah. Mm. But uh, don't lose faith, okay? Faye is for you. He's not going anywhere. Hmm? But look, I'm sure you are surprised that I'm talking good of him right now. Who will not? Well, I was almost kicked out of this house. He stood his ground. And that's one of the reasons why I'm still here today. So he's a very nice person. So I assure you, I'm sure he's going to uh, stay with you. So don't be afraid. I know it looks like we're close, but he has never told me that he likes me. And Faye, he has big dreams. He wants to live a good life. And Madame Flora can help him achieve those dreams. What do I have to offer him? It doesn't look like a desperate man to me. That young man looks focused and determined and he knows what he wants. So he would definitely go for love than a woman that have money. Rashid, I cannot compete with Madame Mo. No matter how you make it seem, she's a better option than me. No, don't look at it that way. Look, just look at me. My damn town. Look. You know what I'm picturing? Yourself with Faye on a frame on your wedding day. Picture perfect, right? Don't worry, it's going to happen. I'll show you that. He's a nice man. So put some smiles on your face, baby. Don't worry, don't worry. Let me rush to go and pray, okay? Then, chill, chill, chill. <laughs> tam, tam, don't be sad. Mm. Yes, come in. Watching your food. Thank you. Hey, why are you in a hurry? So I just thought to mention, I mean, all of your bond with Kayla, it's so admirable and seamless. You know, you would make a good mom someday. Thank you. What are you doing here? Um, I brought him his food. You brought him his food? Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> um, Lady Flora, is there anything you want me to do for you? Yes. I'll be going out in a bit. I know, I usually don't go out at this time, but today has to be an exception. I'm just a bit frustrated and stressed, so I need to get rid of them. So I'll just wait up for you to finish your food, get dressed, and... Oh, okay. Go. Okay. That's done. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Um, did something bite your lip? No. Then why are you touching you like this? You like asking questions. Do you need something? Nope. I just came to keep you company as your best friend. <laughs> and I asked my mom to buy some chocolate. You did? Mm -hmm. Why? That is because you're my best friend. And my class teacher said you should always share with your friend. Oh, that's so thoughtful of you. Thank you. You're such a good girl. Thank you. And I always want you to be happy. You know what will make me really happy? Tell me. For my dad to come back to my mom and you become a big, gigantic, 
happy family. And you do know that's possible, right? Yes. So just close your eyes and make a wish. I have made the wish. Wonderful. Do you need some help? No, I'm good. Please, can I help you? Could you please wish? Mm -hmm. You. Can I at least do No, something? don't worry. I'm so bored, please. All right, let me get this. Coffee before, but I'm so hot. Can't you get the coffee? You? Yeah, come in. Mm -hmm. Your coffee lady flower. Um, Faye, come to my room right now. Madam, would that be all? Yes, you can go. Madam, I think your bed is sand. Let me dust it for yeah. you. You can go. You don't want to. do that tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. Okay. The can chair. you move away from the sofa? I said you can go. You want to be left alone? Yes. Okay, good. Then let me tell you not to bother coming since you want to be left alone. I I've already to... told you. Besides, I haven't even asked you to do that. It's high time you left already. No, go. You can go. Oh, Faye. Lady Flora. Uh huh. Is there a place you want me to drive you to this night? No. I just have a burden on my shoulder. I mean, I feel really heavy. So I wanted a meal hand to massage it. That wouldn't be a problem, would it? Oh. No, it's fine. I can help out. I thought so. Get up. Yes, on the bed. <laughs> okay. Mm hmm. My shoulder won't come to you. You have to come to it. Oh, it's just on the shoulder. My calf hurts. My shoulder. I'm dying here. <laughs> Go on. The neck down. Here. <laughs> yes, there. No. Where? Here. The neck. 
Ó, oh, uh, Trump cat. No. Hot. No. Hot. No. Tamara. Mr. Just give me a loan. Give you a loan. What's wrong? Can you leave me alone? Give you a loan. Yes, just leave me alone. Why? Okay, just leave me. That's fine. The mechanic, they're waiting for you. To fix the car. Oh, okay. I'll get the keys. Tamara, Lady Flora, is there anything going on between Faye and yourself? No, no, nothing at all. It had better be nothing. It had better be nothing at all. I've gotten the foil. Oh, that's so kind. Awesome. Good job. Um, hold up. Um, I need to show you something upstairs. You have to come with me. Okay, Lady Flora. Okay, Lady Flora. You're a fine man. I want you. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, but I can't do this. But you told me you do not have a girlfriend. Yes, I don't. I don't have a girlfriend, but I have someone I'm in love with. Okay. I think I see where this is headed. Sinfi. I don't want to have anything serious with you. I mean, I'm not crazy. I I'm sorry. I I just want to feel good. I'm so sorry, Mom, but I can't. I can't. Okay. I'll pay you. Handsomely. Please, ma. I'm very sorry. I can't. Just this once. I'm sorry, ma. I don't think you're in the right frame of mind right now. Please. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is the point when you get out. I'm sorry, no, I, I can't. I can't leave you like this. What? <laughs> I'm a bit confused here. You can't give me what I want and you can't go. No, I... Get out. No, ma'am, please. I, 
feel like you have a lot of things to get out of your chest. The last day at the club when you were drunk, you said a lot of things and I feel maybe if you say them now that you're sober, it could help. <laughs> okay. So I'm... I'm supposed to be telling my driver my personal problems. Uh, seems like you've forgotten your place. It's just been a couple of seconds, I mean. Yes. Get out. Please, ma. Just let me help you. Talking might really help. Please. Oh, God. I feel so embarrassed right now. Ma. Flora, what have you done? What have you done? Ma, I'm not judging you. I'm not judging you. I just want to help. From everything you said, Lady Flora, I, I think you, you're in love with your husband still. Ex-husband. Ex-husband. He's yep. a betrayer and a cheat. So he's an ex. Yeah, but you still feel something for him. I don't care about him. He left me for another woman. Yeah, but you said... He pleaded with you to take him back. I'm sure he will never do this again. You're the one that pushed him away. How are you so sure that he's with her? I don't know. But I did him the honor of filing for a divorce. I gave him a divorce so he can go and be with her and crown it all. <laughs> it, it hurts when your partner cheats on you, so I can imagine the amount of hurt and pain he must feel. Our home was peaceful. We were the envy of other couples. And then he went and cheated. He has never cheated before, but then this one time, he cheated. Now, you might not want to hear this, Lady Flora, but don't you think he might be genuine with his apologies and probably really, really regrets it and really might not do it again. I mean... Okay. In point, did he cheat? Yes, he did. Would I ever have expected him to behave like that or sleep with another woman? No, I did not because I was always available. I made him feel like the head of the house, even though I was wealthier. He has no excuse. He has no excuse for that action. I mean, I, I think you should forgive him. You said he was never a cheat, right? Just forgive him. This whole separation thing might just have this much toll on you because you still love him. You will agree with me that you still love him, right? <sighs> Lady Flora, please, just forgive him. At least for your own healing sake and probably for the sake of the child you both have together. <sighs> he still reaches out to you. I blocked him on every single platform. After I gained custody of our daughter, I felt there was a restraining order against him. Perhaps I should start by unblocking him. Hello? Flora, please don't hang. Hello? Oh my God, Flora. Flora, please. I regret it. Do you want to come over and discuss what happened? Hello? Is this really Flora? Okay, I'm sorry I called. Sorry. No, 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 no. I will come. I will come. I'll come to the house. When? Weekend. All right. I'll come. How is Kayla? She's fine. She keeps asking and talking about you. Oh, my little angel. See you weekend.
So the good news is that your daddy is visiting this weekend. What? You don't seem happy. You said he abandoned us. Oh, God, yes, Flora, you said that. Mommy spoke from a place of anger, and that was very wrong of me. Daddy did not abandon us. He would never. He loves you so much. I love him too. <laughs> I know you miss him. So, Daddy is visiting this weekend. I, can't wait to see you. <laughs> I guess so. So, school back time. Okay. Yes. Yes. Time to march out. Dum 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 dum. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Paru. Oh, my food? Oh, please take it to him. To who? Tam Tam, look. Take this food to him yourself. I am busy. My trouser got torn and I'm sewing it. Okay, no problem. Finish sewing your trouser and then take it to him. No, I won't. Tell me, why don't you want to take the food to him? Rashid, why are you asking me all these questions? Are you going to take it to him or not? I'm not. I'm sorry. So what's the meaning of this? Why are you bugging me when you're with her? With who? Relax. Stop pretending. You're sleeping with Madame Flora. What? <laughs> I... What? You think this okay, is funny? Okay. <laughs> oh, really? It's funny, right? You cannot be with both my boss and myself, okay? You can't eat your cake and have it for you. You chose to be with her, so stick with it. I'll be fine. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't look like you're fine. <laughs> you have jealousy written all over your face. Oh, please, <laughs> you wish. <laughs> you think this is a joke? No. <laughs> look, honestly, I can't help but love you. It's really? just too much. <laughs> you can't love me and my madame at the same time. No. <laughs> You can't be with her and be with me at the same time. Fine, she's a better option than me, I know. Obviously, you will choose her over me anytime, any day. She's richer and she'll take care Thank of you. you so it's quite... Come here. I can't believe you just kissed me. With the same lips you used to kiss her. Oh my God. You know what? You men are just... You just use this. Oh, stop. Okay, enough. All right. I said nothing happened between Lady Flora and I. There's nothing. You have to trust me, right? I can't do anything to hurt you. Cheap lies. Oh, God. Okay, that night you went into her room. I stood outside her door waiting for you to come out and you never did. God. God. The other time too, right in front of me, she led you into her room. Okay, okay. So, let's start from the first, right? So the first time she called me in to help her give her a body massage and that was all I did. All right, then the second time, we just went into discourse and we talked. That was all. All right, there's nothing between Lady Flora and I. Nothing. How am I supposed to believe you? 
Uh, are you going to pretend that you don't know that she has feelings for you? That she wants and likes you? Okay, yeah, I'm not going to try to deny it. I know, right? But then, right now, she won't want anything to do with me in that regard. Okay, look, believe me, there is nothing between the both of us. Nothing has ever happened and will never happen. How will I know? Oh, you have to trust me. Okay, like, I choose you. Can I kiss your sweet lips? After kissing it, how can I kiss any other person again? Huh? Come here. So that's why you've been acting very funny since. Come. Right. I'm sorry, I, I missed you. What? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, babe. Good news. So I just got the job I've been wanting since. Oh my god! Wow! <laughs> That's yes. 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 Oh, oh my god! Yes! Oh my god! I'm so happy! Wow! Whoa, yeah, 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 yeah! Oh my god! Oh my god! god. Congratulations! <laughs> yes, this is good news! Oh. <laughs> Oh, I missed you so much. How are you? I'm fine. Kella, come let me show you something. I don't want to go. Come let me show you something. Bye. Bye. I swear I regret it. It cost me my family. My happy family. I'm sorry. No, don't. I'm sorry. It's going to take time for us to fix this. I know. And I'm willing to try. I'm sorry. I know. Thank you. Let's go upstairs. After you. <laughs> Hey, babe, at least wear a smile on your face. I'm used to seeing you every day, serving you meals every single day. And now you're leaving, you want me to smile? I can't. At least we're in the same town. I can come see you every day if that will make you happy. I know, but it's going to take some time for me to get used to that. Besides, what if you meet another girl and you start liking her? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this your sense of humor is unbeatable. Really? Babe, how do I say this again? My heart beats for only you. Alright. Anyway, okay, you know what? I'll come over every single day. Every single day. If that will make you happy, at least I'll get free food every time I come. <laughs> like, babe, let me just go and make money so that at least I can support you with your business and then come and marry you. You like that, eh? Now that's my baby smiling. Come here. Come here. My heart beats for only you. Tamara. My heart beats for you too. Oh, Faye, I see you're set to go. Yes, my dear. We'll certainly miss you. I've been thinking of a replacement for you, and I know it's going to be very difficult. I mean, with the amount of careless drivers we have on the streets. 
<laughs> I will miss you people too. That's kind. Your salary. You want to give me an account? Uh, it's the same account ah. I've been using since. I thought since you were leaving, perhaps you're changing that one too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's still the same one. Okay. Okay. Mm -mm. You want to check? Wow, Ma, this is bigger than my salary. No, I just added a token as a gift from me to you. Oh, thank you very much, Ma. I'm very grateful. You're welcome. Very grateful. Take good care of yourself. Thank you, Ma. Tamara! Lady Sarah! Won't you come and see your boyfriend off? They play. You honestly thought I don't know. Of course I know. You changed your mode of dressing. You've got this um, wig on your head. <laughs> Maybe she will. Please see him off. Thank you, Ma. Yes, you can hold the shoulder now. miss you. Yeah, I'll miss you too. Please help me take care of my sweethearts for me. I will. I won't allow any man to come close to her. <laughs> Even the new driver that Madame is going to employ her. Look at her. Even blowing his left hand. That one. Yes. Good one. <laughs> Baby, I'll miss you. Take care of yourself. Yeah, you too. And remember to come home for dinner. <laughs> yes, I will. I'm coming to take you out of this place soon. Oh. Okay. Rashid, I'm coming to take her. You'll miss her very soon. You go to both of us, yes. though. Yeah. Yes, I'm not going to leave my tam tam to anybody. <laughs> <laughs> and you to leave all those chiringa, that especially that one. Leave her. <laughs> <laughs> uh, bye bye. All right, bye. It's not to be here anymore. It's been two years, two months, two hours ago Since the last time you hit the road And this house has not been the same I saw the missed calls, flowers, and letters you wrote Saying you're sorry for breaking the trust And this heart has not been